So, Trevor, why don't you tell us about this? Matt Cardona is getting extreme? So, yeah. Um, as everyone knows, I am into all types of wrestling. And I am a very huge fan of uh, CCW and things like that. So, over the weekend, Matt Cardona, apparently, and if you don't know who Matt Cardona is, Z- Zach Ryder. Um, Matt Cardona, Con- Cardona was, was bored, apparently, and had uh, and said, you know what? I'm going to do something different, something I've never done before. He he shows up to GCW. And if you don't know Game Change Wrestling, if you're not, not familiar with it, it is a promotion that was started primarily for, based around Nick Gage pretty much, is the, is the champion. Um, great promotion, by the way. They're doing good, job, good things over there. Um, big ups to Game Change Wrestling. Big ups to Nick Gage and everything you've been through, bro. You, I'm, one, I'm a, one of your fans. Um, so anyway, as we all know, if you haven't figured it out or haven't seen it, uh, John Moxley has done a, pro, a brief little, uh, appearance in GCW with, uh, Nick Gage, gave him the, um, the, uh, Death Rider. Um, and hopefully all of his fans are hoping that it sets up a, a death match between two of, two of the best to do death matches. Um, so you Nick Gage defends his belt, and you see this this figure come up, and he kind of he's, he's all black, and he comes kind of dances, kind of like you know wildly like uh like uh, John Moxley does, and everyone in the crowd, even the announcers, like, wait a minute, that looks familiar. Is 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 that who who is it who we think it is? And he delivers a Death Rider. Get and pops back up, and the announcer is going crazy. Oh, it's John Moxley! Everyone in the arena is loving it. Figure takes his hood off, and who do we see? Matt, none other than Zack Ryder himself, saying it pretty much like, "Yeah." And, and those those cheers quickly turn to boos. Those boos quickly turn to "fuck Zack Ryder." It is the funniest thing. Like, like start "fuck Zack Ryder." Blah. Even the announcer's like, "What?" Is like he, he's like is that Zach Matt Card no, like he didn't know what to even say, and honestly I think it's brilliant because who the hell thought Matt Cardona was so up in game changer wrestling like the most extreme thing that Matt Cardona's ever done is wrestle a good match. I mean not saying he's bad because I actually like Matt Cardona I do, but like then when he's allowed to actually wrestle, that's like the most extreme thing that he's ever done. Like he was another talent that WWE wasted. Um, And he's been doing great things in impact. I would love to see him stay in AEW, but I honestly believe this is one of the smartest moves he's done for his career. At the end, when he's walking out, he shoots a a quick promo, pretty much saying, this is Zack Ryder. Oh, fuck Zack Ryder. Zack Ryder is fucking dead. I'm now Matt Cardona, like, which right. is great. I, I like it, but I'm hoping this sets up a match, a death match between him and Nick, and Nick Gage. Now I've never seen z- him do anything like this. So it'd be very interesting to see. What are your, what are your thoughts Omar? I big props to the guys at dark side of the ring. And Nick Gage is so over. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> <It's insane>. <laughs> <laughs> Dark Side of the Ring's biggest accomplishment is making me care about Nick Gage. That is, uh, <laughs> you weren't familiar with Nick Gage. No, I wasn't, and and, and, and it, it, I like it wasn't my cup of tea. But you know, right. like like it's, but it's, you know what? It's great for wrestling. Thank you, yeah. Dark Side of the Ring. Great for wrestling. I love this because we're getting to see another side of Matt Cardona, aka Zack Ryder. We're getting to see this 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 dark side. Him as a heel. Him as someone who wants to be hated. Him as someone who's wrestling this death match potentially. Right. And with Nick Gage, who's who's I, I, using his own words, fucking crazy. Uh, yeah. Like like that's like that's something people want to see. I want to see it. And. I'm going to start paying a little more attention to GCW in my uh, wrestling <laughs> regiment now, thanks to this. And that's good. That's great. Like, again, is everyone's thriving. I, I love the fact that, you know, Nick Gage, his story got told, and like, now he's doing some of the best work of his career. And he's having, like, feuds that people are going to care about and that, like, people outside of the circle of extreme yeah. wrestling are going to care about. That's what's dope about all of this, and I'm, I can't wait. I mean, because the, the, the thing is, when it comes to... Just those, wait, wait. 
Nick Gage, just l- l- listen to what I'm saying, though. <laughs> <laughs> I know you love extreme wrestling. We all do sometimes, right? But don't don't hurt the money maker, man. That is a yeah, million it, dollar face, yeah. in Zack Ryder. It is. <laughs> it's like, like, it's, don't like, don't fuck with a money maker. <laughs> And you know that's that's in the contract. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, we we saw how well that went for David Arquette. <laughs> Thanks for watching this video from Real Take Sports Talk. Remember to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you get notified whenever a new video is released. Also remember to check out our live show every single Thursday at 8 p.m. right here on the YouTube channel. And remember, keep it real.